Hello and welcome to Craftwatch, your weekly updates to the goings on on the Sanitarium.fm station server. I am your host, Predicted Cyborg. Hello. And so, to the server news section, we don't really have news of any big changes, however, the, there is a warning now going around the server to tell people that somebody might be going around and stealing farm animals and other people's pets. The first theft was noticed earlier today when I went out to the place I was going to go tour and we found that the chicken pen was completely empty, much to everybody's surprise. While it cannot actually be confirmed whether it's, there is somebody taking all these animals, it is advised that you keep an eye on your pens, make sure that all gates are firmly locked and, well, microchip your dogs and your cats, basically. Because if somebody's stealing them, we don't particularly know what's happening to them. They, they could all be in a big field somewhere, they could be being released, or they could end up as uh, meat. So yeah, if you've got any animals that you don't want to have go missing, make sure they're locked up safely. Uh, I tried to reach Learn Samurai for a quote, but unfortunately he has... Uh, he's kind of... I think he's wandered off into the wilderness somewhere to build his house, so I couldn't really reach him. I will keep trying though, and any statement that we get from him or, or anyone else on the mod team concerning this, I will update you with uh, more news. And speaking of the tour section, here it is, to the tour section of the show. And we come to the tour section of the show, as always, the section where I show off uh, one of the builds that one of the people on the server have built. And those of you who are looking around this will realise that this is actually a very nice little garden in the sky. Why does that sound familiar? It's because the same person has built it. Hello again, sis. Where are you? There you are. Hello. Hello again. Yeah, I like to stick to a theme. Yeah. Uh, so, tell me about the build. Well, again, this is my Zen garden. Uh, this time we have mushrooms. Because our fearless leader wanted to have some fun. Um, yeah. It's almost done. I'm just waiting on a delivery of some jungle ferns because we know the issue with jungles we aren't allowed to go there <laughs> are you gonna but, get uh, any more rabbits up here uh i'm gonna try I'm gonna try uh yeah i'm gonna get some rabbits and bring back my vines jungle ferns benches the whole the whole nine yards it's just i keep forgetting about it because it's on top of my roof and i never come up here <laughs> So, yeah. Anyways. Then we have my fence that you get stuck on. Uh, <laughs> main, main suite. Um, I, uh, if you remember my last build, it was just straight up sandstone, but I decided to go a little bit extra and make it the, uh, chiseled? Yeah. Something. Nice, nicer sandstone. Um, doesn't look as ugly when you see it from the side here, or when you uh, go up and down stairs. It was a big problem. Like, just for me. I didn't like it. Um, <laughs> anyways, we have our table. Again, dining table. And uh, once I get my brewing station up and running, this will be my bar. Bar stools here. And dispenser with nothing in it currently, but... It'll dispense some drinks for you, and it'll be a good little party hub. I'm looking forward to it. Um, and then we have, once again, my kitchen. You know, fridge, counter, ovens. You know. Yeah, you've got, you got a lot of ovens, so, you know, yeah. if, if you want to have a party, yeah, there's, yeah. there's going to be a lot of steak. Yeah, well, it was handy, too, for... Uh, cooking up all the glass that I needed. Yeah, I have noticed very pretty windows this time. Yes, I quite like them. They're very uniform. Spent a lot of time. And, uh, yeah. Then we have my bedroom? Yes, bedroom. Also my chest room. Um, I started out with very organized chests, and then I gave up on that. Because 
that's too I much. I think most fun. people do. And uh, another another <laughs> unique carpet. Yeah, I like to keep it interesting, to say the least. And uh, yeah, I I think I'm gonna take out the green and maybe replace it with blue, because the green and the orange, the green just does, it clashes too much. I don't like it that much. But yeah, that's minor minor details. Uh, I did reinstall my chandelier, but mainly so that spiders don't spawn up there. Because if that wasn't there, that'd just be pitch black and terrifying. It's a very high ceiling. Yep. Uh, I noticed when building, well, not when building, um, if you notice on the outside, every corner is, I think, dark oak? Wood, not wood planks. And as I was digging down from the top and counting, <clears throat> I was like, hey, there's 27 blocks to each corner. This is weird. And uh, and so I just spent a few minutes and I counted and I made it, I accidentally made a cube or an almost cube. Um, 26 by 26 by 27. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah. So I was like, huh. I like my brain sometimes. <laughs> I accidentally do really neurotic things. And also, for both levels, I uh, made sure that I had wood underneath so that you couldn't see the marble and so that I wouldn't have the drippy roof problem I did with my last house. Because that was also really irritating because I had a drip right above my bed. And on my chest. And yeah. This is my main floor. Um, nice viewing window again. You can see the mountains, uh, my temple builds, and can you see my flag? I don't think you can see my flag from here, but there's a flag. You can see it on the map. Because, um, you know, being the only Canadian on the server, thought I had to show some pride. <laughs> oh, so you, it, 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 it was you who put the Canadian flag there. Did you, did, did, you, did you submit those forms? Uh, pardon? Ah, oh, it's um, it's it, a thing. A thing that um, when we found out about the Canadian flag, I had to put out an announcement to say that um, forms needed to be submitted. Oh, <laughs> oh I didn't get that memo. Um, well, now, now, <laughs> now you have, so you can take care of that as soon as possible. Yes, I'll. I guess have to. Yeah. Um, anyways, we have a much smaller, uh, diving platform because we're not in an ocean this time. We're in a very, uh, confined river, so to speak. Um, but if you do fall and you're above land, you definitely have enough time to react and move into water. I was, when I was putting in the fence along the top, around the top there, I fell off, and I fell off right where my farm is, like directly over land, and I was, I fell and I was like, oh no, I'm gonna die, and then I was like, wait, I have like 10 seconds to move here, I'm good. <laughs> it's pretty ridiculous. Um, anyways, we have cake, I just, when I get tired from climbing my ladder, I'll eat some cake, and it's very slowly going away. Um, but I do have trying to get sort of a library-ish set up so I can get an enchanting table in here because mm -hmm. the more books the higher the level sort of thing so yeah, I kind of want books out to the third torch and I might just knock those torches out and put books and yeah books out to the third again and then maybe a book roof I just I like books they look nice and I like when they're... I see that the, uh, the, the the hot tub made the journey across. Yes, couldn't leave them behind. Oh, I do need stairs right there. No, with this carpet, no. But yeah. I was thinking of making it bigger, but then... I don't know. It might get an expansion or two. There's a lot of space. Uh, Minecraft physics. <laughs> In action. <laughs> yeah. Oh dear. That's my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> you sit on the seat and get your feet wet. Yeah. Wet. Uh, 
what? Yeah. Well, I suppose, um... Anyways, I think that's it for up here. More chandeliers. Spiders don't spawn. When, when I was building this one, I didn't make any windows. Like, I was just building a cube, essentially. And I ran, by the third time I ran out of wood, I was thinking to myself, like, this is stupid. Why do I keep having to go and demolish this forest? Like, this is ridiculous. It shouldn't be taking up this much wood. I don't remember my last house taking up this much wood. And so, by the third time I ran out, it was, I had, I went and got enough so that I could finish <clears throat> my second floor and the roof. And, uh, the wood portion of the second floor, um, because I hadn't gone to get sandstone yet. <clears throat> and, uh, I finish it off and I'm climbing down, and I <laughs> climb down into the second, um, off the roof and in into my second area here. And I was like, oh, this is terrifying, because I could literally see about three blocks in front of me. <laughs> the whole empty space. I'm like, oh yeah, I should probably make some windows because uh, this is this isn't good. This is monster monster area. <laughs> this is dark. Yeah, it was. I actually, I like, I got, legit got a bit scared. I was just like, oh, oh, okay, we're gonna change this. And where's my farm over here? We <clears throat> descend. Oh, good. The tower of pimps came with you. Yes, I put some effort into finding enough gold for that, and um, <laughs> obsidian. Yeah, we have my little farm. There's gonna be... We have sheep, we have cows, we have chickens in the roof there. Um, so yeah, there's gonna be one more pen for pigs, and I might make a separate stable if I tame a horse or two. But yeah. We have my wheat. And I want to get potatoes. And uh, the sticky thing. Carrots. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And Lone brought me a tree so that I could have my um, cocoa for cocoa cake and cookies. Yes. But yeah. And we have my sheep. They're all Ooh, boy. It is a mosh pit in there. They've they've been busy. Okay. But yeah, um I'm going to turn some sheep. sheep. Turn some sheep blue. Cuz yeah, I don't I like the green on the sheep, but I don't like the green on the carpet. Like it doesn't it doesn't change well. I don't rah, stupid sheep. Well, I suppose, I, suppose, I, suppose, I suppose if you wanted to make more room, you wanted to release some of the sheep. You could always release the green ones because they've got camouflage. That's true. They do very well in the wild. Um, Where are you? In oh, my, there you are. In my... In the middle of your sugar. Yeah. I, li I, just, I like this design. Oh, jeez. Hi. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I like this design. I, uh didn't put much thought into it, but... I this, it, 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 this, this is actually really nice. You should, you should, you should, make, um, you should make like a sugarcane maze or something. Oh, that's an awesome idea. Huh. <laughs> put, 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 put that on the list of things that, that, that we need to do, but we probably never will. <laughs> yeah, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, I had to go all the way back to uh, home base there to spawn for one cow, and then on the way back I found two more, I think. And I hiked around the mountains, um, behind one of my temples there was another two cows, so I brought them back. And cows are really, really dumb. And I had to fight through internet connectivity issues too, because my internet would start to drop and so the cows would just stand there. Like, they wouldn't wander because the last time I was fully connected, they were following the wheat. But they also wouldn't follow me anymore. And so I just had to stand there and wait for them to actually look at me again. Which is when I knew I was connected again. But yeah, that took a ridiculous amount of time. 
And so I've just been breeding them so that I could get more, more leather, more books, you know, self-sustaining. I like it. And then if we, did I put up a ladder? I put up a ladder. Around back here we have my chickens. Bark, bark. And, okay. Did I? Well, um. Huh. I may not have actually found eggs to make chickens. Or okay. else somebody has been here and stolen them all. Um, uh, breaking news, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Somebody has stolen all of Sis's chickens. Yeah. Uh, case of the missing chickens. Okay. So, uh, huh. uh, list, 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 uh, list, list of suspects will debut at 9 o'clock tonight. <laughs> yeah, okay. Now, well, it's a very nice area for chickens when I get them back or get them in general. I'm not too sure. <laughs> Hmm. Okay, then. Okay. Yeah, uh, that's the farm. This is my very first mine. Um, wasn't all that fruitful. But yeah, my very first mine. So I left the mushroom cap. And, uh, a sign? Oh, I had a sign. I moved the sign. Put it somewhere else. Okay. But yeah. I like mushroom caps. And the yeah. to build stuff in. I know, I like... Uh taking out the stalks and leaving the caps. They're fun. So, um, so have you, have you got plans to build anything more here? Like, like an, I, know, I know that you said that you're looking to build a pig pen and improve the zen garden. Anything else? Um, I was thinking... But I'm also really lazy. But I do want to put in, like, where am I looking here? Uh, my mountains are this way. Um, I do kind of want to put in, like, a railway feature to take you to my temples. But at the same time, if you're going to make the trek, you're not as devoted if you just take a rail railway. So I might just make a rail, like, uh, what are they called? Uh, roller coasters. Wow. Um, you can see that bit of empty mm-hmm. planes over there through the trees. Might make just That'd a roller coaster. Wee. A nice yeah. little fun ride. But yeah. That's been... This is my little area. And I guess I have new neighbors, so I'll have to go <laughs> uh, rubberneck. No, well, <laughs> see what I mean, they're uh, up to. There's, there's, a, there's enough tools on Craftwatch. You'll probably be able to see um, some of those. But... Uh, yeah, I think That's I think this is probably all, about all we have time for. Um, thank you very much for showing me your area, and yeah. uh, I hope that the roller coaster goes well. You're uh, very welcome. Let's, uh, you find who stole the chickens. Um, and so now we come to the final part of the show, the Mojang slash General Minecraft section of the show, and uh, we're going to be talking about some of the latest uh, snapshot stuff that's come out. So, as you know, 1.9 is approaching. We're not entirely sure when it's going to be coming out, but uh, snapshots have already been being released. The first snapshots dealt with some things that weren't exactly combat related, adding in uh, the parts for the Ender Ga- new Ender Gateway portal and various other things. Now we're actually beginning to get some of the new combat stuff added. There's already been a few tweaks to the dragon, although I'm not entirely sure if they've actually finished turning the battle from the PC version to the console version, or more akin to the console version. And uh, also, as of uh, the recent updates to the last snapshot, there has actually been the addition of the shields, which is uh, one of the new combat things that are going in, and basically I really do hope they work against Scarlet and Arrows because they're just so annoying. But yeah, apparently everything is still not balanced, so you know, if, if you try and get out, do keep in mind that you're not playing the final thing. It's uh, The values are going to change still, and also, as always, you know, you, you have to sort of remember, make, make a special separate little profile for doing snapshot stuff, because this is all very early sort of alpha stuff, and it could corrupt your game, so don't blame me if you go into your world and it gets corrupted because you didn't make a separate profile. 
Uh, but there's also a few other things that have come in that uh, we weren't actually warned about. Like, for example, they're going to be adding in some of the arrow stuff, yes. And uh, they're also adding a new class of potions called Lingering. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what the effect, how a Lingering potion differs from the rest of them. But I'm going to guess that the effect sticks around for a little bit longer. Or maybe, rather than just disappearing, sort of ge gently goes down over time. I don't know. Uh, if I get more information, I will tell you during the next craft watch. And that does it for what the server's been up to this week. Reminder that our server is open to all players who want a little uh, chill out vanilla space to play Minecraft in and to just generally build. The address, in case you need the URL, is www.sanitarium.fm and it's exactly the same as the station's URL address, so if you know the website address, you will be able to get into the server. And if you have something that you want me to talk about during the next show, all you have to do, uh, go look at the video description under this video and there is a link there to the topic where you can go and provide the details and if you put your stuff up there, you might see it in the next show. Thank you for watching and I will see you next week. Bye bye. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you check out some of these other videos from sanitarium.fm and follow us on Facebook and Twitter. The information is right below that big shiny subscribe button.